And we've been watching those two tropical waves yeah. in the Atlantic. Uh, one of them we've been keeping a close eye on for the past couple of days. Within the past 20 minutes or so, it was upgraded to a tropical depression. So we have been watching the one shaded in orange. It does have a medium chance of development, but the one I'm focusing on right here is the one shaded in red. So our graphics and our system sometimes takes a little bit to catch up. So this area, it has officially developed into tropical depression number three. Now I know that probably sounds a little scary to some people, especially as we are still recovering from Hurricane Ian. I want to break down the models for you and show you why it is still way too early to worry about this disturbance out there. So let's take a closer look. Models are very much in agreement through at least Friday morning. Here's where they start to really get a little different here. So you have some of the models having it moving out to the Atlantic, but as a stronger storm. But if it's a stronger storm, it's okay because they're keeping it as a fish storm well away from the Caribbean and also well away from us here in Southwest Florida. But as we go through the other models, you can see it takes a little bit further to the west, but we have a lot of wind shear right here. So even if it does take it further to the west through the Caribbean by about Sunday morning, it's that wind shear that's going to keep it as a weaker system. So we have two choices right here with the current models. One, a fish storm going to be a stronger system, a weaker storm moving through the Caribbean. But you know, just as well as I do, there is still plenty of time between now and Sunday morning for things to change. So really all you need to worry about is this is something we are watching. It's a reminder to check in with us at least once a day so that way you are in the know and also just know that we are in the thick of your hurricane season. You want to make sure you do have that hurricane plan in place. Regardless of any of that development uh, through the next couple of days, we could have our next name storm and the next name on the list is going to be Brett. Right behind it is Cindy and we do have that other tropical wave that we are watching.